I think we can dress her up nicer than this. It's time for Extreme Golf Cart Makeover, right now on GCG TV. Hey, welcome back to the Golf Cart Garage for Extreme Golf Cart Makeover. We've got some work to do, but we'll wrap up today's episode by announcing our sweepstakes winners for this month. So visit our homepage at the link in the video description if you want to be next. The homepage has your chance to win a monthly prize or enter to win the $3,000 grand prize in our season finale. There's even a video there to walk you through the entering process. So bookmark that page. Today, we're looking at installing an extended top and a folding windshield on the 2006 EasyGo TXT we've been remodeling this season. We're going with some options from Red Dot that are both great matches for the Storm Body Kit installation. We reinstalled the OEM front struts we removed during teardown using the retained hardware. And we've said it before, but it's a great time for a reminder to document everything during that process. Photos of electrical connections and plastic bags of removed hardware with labels were really helpful while reassembling everything. Then we matched up the innovative modular nature of the Storm body kit with an 84 inch red dot top sail bimini top. Another American made customization here that had a great outcome. This top is also available for multiple models and even for some six seater carts in a 120 inch option. Once the frame is assembled, it's time to weave the cover over the top frame, which, if you don't read the directions, can result in some failed attempts, some frustration, and writing a Paul Simon parody song that we would title, 50 Ways to Weave Your Cover. I'm offering bonus points to anyone that likes that joke. We'll understand if you unfriend us over this. Anyway, after a couple attempts that came out kind of loose or uneven, we decided to use zip ties on almost every loop and tighten them incrementally and evenly in much the same way that you might tighten lug nuts. Once in place and stretched out, we weaved the lacing by starting in the center of one end and finding the center of the lace. We then weaved each end around each side to the other end and tied off. This method seems to get the tightest and most even results for us. This style of top is a sunshade, so maybe it's not for every environment, but once assembled, it installed easily using the correct brackets for our configuration. And we loved the fact that it came out looking fantastic and delivered easily. Rooftops usually require a long delivery on a huge truck they have to go on a pallet, but this was simple to receive and install to the cart. We'll wrap up this episode with the folding windshield made just for the Storm body kit. Just like our top and seats, we're looking at awesome American-made quality here. We chose a tinted acrylic, but as always, we can help you find the options you need right here in the garage. The highlight of this windshield with the body kit was the border gasket at the bottom to follow the body lines and protect that paint job. This was a great finishing touch that shows the thought and design strategy that goes into this awesome line of products, and we couldn't be happier with the results. We'll link all these items in the video description to make them easy to find right here at golfcartgarage.com. And speaking of finishing, next time we'll be installing all the extras like that rug that really ties the room together along with some other awesome accessories, so don't miss out on the rest. Visit the series homepage at the address on your screen or the link in the video description for sweepstakes details and to enter our monthly drawing. It's quick and painless to enter, and you can re-enter each month for even more chances to win. Entries are open right now for our June giveaways, so don't wait. Visit the series homepage to enter for your chance to be one of the six June winners, or submit your video entry to be considered for the $3,000 grand prize in our season finale. Here are the six lucky winners taking home Golf Cart Garage store credit this month. 
Third prize this month goes to Danny B from Michigan, who won $50 for his Yamaha. And Cameron W from South Carolina, who won $50 for his Yamaha. Second prizes are being awarded to Tina S from North Carolina, who won $100 for her club car. And David P from Missouri, who won $100 for his Easy Go. And cheers to our first place winners for May. Susie G from Washington won $200 for her Easy Go. And Brian Wilson from Delaware won $200 for his Easy Go. And I'm not even going to make a Beach Boys joke about it. Make sure you bookmark that homepage so you can follow the whole season's transformation and enter to win big for your cart too. Congratulations to our winners from all your friends right here in the garage. If there's anything we can do to help with your project, just stop by golfcartgarage.com or give us a call at 1-800-401-2934 so we can help show you around the garage. And while you're here, give us a like and subscribe to our channel for more episodes. Thanks for watching GCGTV.